Good to see you. Good to see you, man. Always a pleasure. Always a pleasure. Appreciate it. You got it. It's rolling. It's rolling. Radio Raheem here with Triple G, Yanati Golovkin. First of all, I didn't talk to you after the Brook fight. Congratulations yeah. on that very exciting Thank win. You very much. Yeah. It was exciting because it seemed in that fight he hit you more than anyone else had that I'd seen. Do you agree with that? Why do you think that is? You know, yeah, I remember this fight, you know. I respect Kel, you know, he's a very good fighter, you know. And I show him this is my division. 160, this is my division, you know. He's a great fighter, 100%, you know. He's not ready for a long fight, you know, just for five rounds. Did you feel like his skill set was an opportunity for you to learn something or improve anything about your skills? You know, after... You know, after first round, I understand it is finished. After first round, you know, yeah, last couple of rounds he beat me just like, you know, I don't know how, just <laughs> in just five rounds. You said that Danny Jacobs is your favorite fighter. Why? You know, I told you, yeah, you, he's my favorite fighter because you know he beat anything, you know, everybody for his life. I know him long time. He had this very good amateur career. You know, he is true champion, champion his life. This is the fight that you wanted. It puts you one step closer to all the middleweight belts. What do you have to do in this fight that you haven't had to do in any other fight to win? Is Danny, is, is he better than these other guys? Oh, absolutely. You know, right now he's my best fight, fight I think so. You know, my best opponent because he's champion. I respect him. You know, I see he's true champion. You know, he's, he won this fight. And we are in this situation. You know, this, thank you God, this is a big chance for future, for next step, you know, and... But what do you have to do to beat him? What is, what is his, yeah. his... No, I want, I want, you know, I don't steal my job, you know. I know my job, just not left, not right, just, I know my job. <laughs> There's no rematch clause in this fight, and in boxing, it's been a lot of superstition about that one fight before the big one. Yeah. Are you at all concerned about that aspect, like um, having one fight before the Canelo fight, which everybody wants? Yeah. Do you have to be more focused this time and get this guy out quicker so there's nothing that stops you from getting the Canelo fight that everyone wants to see? Yeah, right. Not because the second step, yeah, before, before big fight. No, my focus 100% to Daniel because, you know, I understand who is it. You know, I understand Daniel and I know him. Right now it's very interesting. Yeah, last year I lost a little bit interest because too much talking, too much trash talking, you know, for mm -hmm. everybody use my name, you know, like oh, I want, I'm ready, oh, too much, you know, nobody ready. <laughs> and now, yesterday I saw Dan, Dan, he's really ready. Lastly, you, we know that Canelo is uh, signing another fight now to, f but, to fight Kirkland, but he was willing to fight 165 pounds and take a fight with um, Chavez Jr. When you heard that, that he was willing to not just fight 60, but 65 to fight a different guy, what, what thoughts went through your mind? It's not interest. That's not interest, you know. Right now, in my interest only 160, you know. Right now, I'm champion. Daniel, he's champion. This is very serious, you know. This is very serious. And 165, one blah, 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 and all this. <laughs> and he's just champion, you know. He stayed in 160, he's true champion, like he has all belts, respect. You know, right now, it's nothing. Lastly, if you had to pick between Sounders and unifying all middleweight belts, or Canelo and getting the big money, which fight would you take? Oh, champion. Champion. I need champion. If, if you beat... Yeah. If you beat those two guys, is that enough for you? Do you feel like maybe you'll be done with boxing? It doesn't matter for me. I need champion. I need unification fight. Radio Raheem with Triple G, Yanadi Golovkin. Thank you for taking this fight Absolutely. and the others that you've been willing to take. We hope to see you getting these uh, unified belts behind you. Radio Raheem with Triple G. Thank you Thank so you. much.